guys, and welcome to another episode of Morning Coffee with All That and Some More Media. Today we're going to be talking about April Jones is already cheating on Lil Fizzle Pop, y'all. And also we're going to be talking about Juice World. I want to know, like, did he really die of an overdose? Because there's some new details that are surfacing about his story. Now, we all heard the news the young rapper died while landing in Chicago after a parent overdose. Now, for those of you who don't know who Juice World is, Juice World, whose real name was Jared Higgins, was a 21-year-old rapper who's best known for his SoundCloud success last year with songs like Lucid Dreams and All Girls Are The Same. He quickly signed with Innescope Records in March of 2018. Now, it's been reported by SoundCloud that he was the most streamed artist of the year in 2018 on their platform, the entire platform. So he was really good at what he did. He also was just proclaimed the top new artist at the Billboard Music Awards. He has just passed away from what is being called an apparent overdose, but there's a little more detail to the story. Here's the story. Pretty much they saying that Juice World was transporting drugs on his private jet while flying from Los Angeles to Chicago. Once they started to land in Chicago, they noticed there were feds on the landing strip waiting for them. So in a panic, it is said that Juice World had allegedly took a bunch of painkillers. Not very long after that, he began to convulse in a seizure while the plane was being searched by the feds. Allegedly, immediately it was made known that he had taken a bunch of pills and he not long after that received the Narcan shot. Now, if y'all are not familiar with what the Narcan shot is, Narcan is an antidote to opioid overdose. So it pretty much reverses the effects of opioids. It is said to immediately restore a person's breathing when they have had an overdose. And from what the story is being told, he came back, like he started breathing again and then was rushed to the hospital where he was later reported as dead. Now it ain't no mystery, Chicago is known as Chirac because they have so many unsolved murders, so many missing people, so many deaths and no real confirmation on how the person died. I don't know, but I just feel like we ain't being told everything. I don't think that boy died of a drug overdose. I really don't. Um, we gonna have to wait to see what the autopsy report is, but we all know Juice World was a heavy drug user. So, I mean, I definitely think it contributed, but I don't think that's how he died. What do y'all think? I mean, granted, he had the rock star life, but at the same time, he was 21 years old. But again, I want to know y'all's opinion. I don't know. I'm not sure. Leave a comment and let me know. Now, on to April and Fizz, y'all. Yes, April is out here showing her behind. They saying, that's what the streets are saying. Anyway, the streets saying that. The karma horse has galloped up to April and Fizz. It appears that she may have allegedly been cheating on Fizz already. There's a video that has surfaced of her getting real cozy to a rapper they call FBG Baby Go. But y'all, we already knew this is April Stilo from when Monice exposed it. Remember when Just Hilarious and her had fell out? So Just was going on her little rants with Monice and Monice was recording everything she was saying and released the calls. If y'all remember, let me let y'all hear this. Hey, you're a fucking puppy dog. He, he gonna do whatever the fuck she wanna do and, and all that shit. So I tried to, you know, get back to why I did get back stage. That's my, that's 
you know, a, a secret. And when the fuck did y'all think it was a secret, my nigga? Everybody know y'all fucking and around. Nigga. Get the fuck out of here. Get the fuck out of here, nigga. He was sitting there babysitting while she was just out there living her best life, y'all. So, Mario tried to tell Fizz, but Fizz ain't want to listen. Fizz is just smitten with this girl. I don't know what it is. I mean, she is a beautiful lady, but goodness gracious. If what Just Hilarious is saying is true, not only is that disgusting what she's out there doing, but it's also very dangerous. You know what I'm saying? Passing out and not knowing what she did the night before. What? I don't know, but this is all legend. I don't know. But y'all heard it out her own mouth. That time when she posted naming off all the dudes that wanted to smash her. Y'all know y'all remember that. The game texts me all the time. Bitches love him. And that nigga texts me. He loves me. He respects me. Drew, little fizz. I love you. Happy Mother's Day. I respect you. Shiggy Show. Nate Robinson. Fucking Paul Pierce. Fucking K. Durant. Fucking anybody Shaq. Kill O'Neal. Like, y'all so mad. Celebrity and because I became what y'all thought I wasn't going to become. Oh, so yeah. let me just say that. Yes, I'm a celebrity because of Mario. He had two kids by him. Gang. Ace. All these guys love him. Because the main thing that you said had my, he had it. Ooh, child, that girl is off the hook. But let me know what y'all think about it. Do y'all think she out there? I mean, I'm pretty sure we all know she out there, but that's bad because you done sat up there, let that boy put himself out there, get fired off the tour, and all this mess all behind you. And this is what you do, April, really? I don't know. But leave a comment. Definitely like this video, subscribe, and also make sure you check back for all that and some more. Peace.